Okay, Ashley, can you tell me um, about your Genius Hour project? Everything from creating your idea to the actual project you implemented. Okay, so I started off with wanting to do something about art. And I didn't really know what. So we started off with the timeline, which was really not practical in the sense of Genius Hour. Genius Hour is where you, you do something that you've never done before. And you, you help the community and you help people learn what you learned, pretty much. And so it started off with me finding a partner, which was pretty hard because not everybody likes art the way that I like art. Art is pretty much everything to me. And so then I found Zane. And Zane was chill about it. Like, he liked art, but he could stay focused with it. And I'm, you know, that kind of person. <laughs> And so we teamed up and it was like perfect partnership from the beginning, which really helped with the whole thing. So you don't have a good partner for Genius Hour, you don't have a good Genius Hour project. So then we started brainstorming and we kind of like went straight off, like didn't even think about it. We kind of just started on our project. And that's not what you do for Genius Hour. You have to learn first and then you start. And so when we started, we looked up all these artists and we were like, oh, we're so excited to tell these kids about it and make a timeline, which didn't really make sense. <laughs> Cause you're just gonna go into a classroom and show kids a timeline. They're not gonna, they're not gonna digest anything. So then Ms. Bonner told us about this thing where um, one of her other art teachers that she knew did this thing where the kids went under the table and they did the Michelangelo thing. And then me and Zane, we kind of like sparked this huge idea because um, we, wanted to, we wanted to do this with kids too. Like we wanted to do that. So we came up with some more ideas and we went and talked to our mentor and we came up with the idea of art night. And pretty much we taught the kids everything about these artists while doing what the artist did, which really, really, they probably won't forget what happened. 